CJ, how are you, mate? Yeah, I'm great, thanks. How are you? Yeah, not bad, thanks. You just finished training? Uh, yeah, I just finished now. How was it? Yeah, it was great. Enjoyed the session. It was good. Good stuff. I know you're a fullback by trade, but do you fancy being a tour guide for us, quick? Uh, yeah, no worries. I can do that for you. Nice one. I'll just ask you a few questions while we go as well, if that's all right. So, uh, let's start off right at the start of your day. What did you have for breakfast this morning? Uh, I had poached eggs and toast and then a yoghurt. Oh, nice. Do you enjoy it then? Yeah, it was great. Good stuff. If you have to pick a type of egg, what's your favourite? Uh, for sure poached eggs, but I like scrambled as well. What three things would you take on a desert island? Uh, definitely a football, a picture of my family and probably my PlayStation. And what was the last TV box set you watched? Um, at the moment I'm watching Power, but the last one that I finished was Vikings. Have you got a dream pet? Uh, I want to get a dog when I move out. Have you had a dog before? Uh, yeah, my grandma and granddad had one when I was younger. What breed was it? Uh, German Shepherd. Oh, amazing. Can you remember the last person you called on the phone? Uh, my granddad, actually, because it was his birthday today, so I called him on the way to training. Oh, happy birthday to him. Uh, would you describe yourself as an early bird or a night owl? Uh, I'd probably say a night owl. Sweet or savoury? Uh, savoury for me. Is there one item that you couldn't live without? Uh, footballs. Tell us something about yourself that no one else knows. Um, I'm not sure, let me think. I'm not that interesting, but I watch Gossip Girl, so that's like a kind of a guilty pleasure, you could say. Nothing guilty about that. <laughs> are they the boots you're wearing at the moment? Uh, yeah. Nice one, what type are they? Uh, the Nike Phantoms. Nice one, are they your favourites you've worn? Uh, they're good, but the favourite like when I was younger growing up was the, the CTR 360s and I also like the Magistas. Oh, great shout. So, uh, if you had to choose a job other than being a footballer, what would it be? Uh, when I was younger, I always said I wanted to be in the army. Have you got a favourite joke? Uh, I don't really do jokes, to be honest. <laughs> don't blame you. Uh, can you remember the last song that you listened to? Uh, on the way in this morning, I think the last one was Sold Out Dates by Gunner and Lil Baby. Last one. Do you have a little dance to that? Do you fancy yourself as a dancer? Uh, I'm a bit too stiff for that. <laughs> can you remember the first match that you went to as a fan? Uh, no, but one that was a, a while ago that I definitely remember was when City played Barca in the Champions League. Oh, was that the one at the Etihad? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great game, that. Uh, what's the best part about living in Manchester? Uh, the people. City break or beach getaway? Uh, probably say beach getaway right now because it's so cold in England. What can you not leave the house without? Um, probably say my keys. White or dark chocolate? Uh, white chocolate. Orange or apple juice? Mm, uh, apple for sure. Favourite pizza topping? Uh, margarita or pepperoni. I think given the weather at the moment, I know the answer to this, but summer or winter? Summer for sure. Fancy dress outfit if you had to pick one? Fancy dress. Maybe Spider-Man. What's your favourite city in the world? City? I mean, I can't not say Manchester, right? Yeah, good answer. <laughs> Best stadium you've played in? Uh, Etihad. And was that when you made your debut? Yeah, it was. What was that like? Oh, incredible experience. Uh, enjoyed, enjoyed it all. Uh, have you got another favourite sport apart from football? Uh, I enjoy watching basketball a lot. Have you got a team that you follow? Uh, the Lakers. Oh, nice, yeah. Uh, player that you'd swap shirt, shirts with if you got the chance? Um, let me think. There's a lot, but I just want some of the City player shirts, to be honest. Yeah, don't blame me on that one. Um, describe your pre-match rituals. Are you quite superstitious? Um, yeah, I am a little bit. So with me, normally try and eat the same things before games. And with everything I do, I'll always put it on with my left first. So that left shin pad on first, left sock on, left boot. So I don't like it. I look, don't like it any other way. <laughs> Ask you a few about your teammates now. Who's got the worst dress sense in the team? Um, he's not going to be happy about this, but I've got to say Kieran Slicker. <laughs> what about the sharpest dresser? You can say yourself if you want to. I've got to go for myself there. Yeah, got to back yourself, haven't you? Uh, last minute penalty, who would you want on it? From uh, your, your teammates now or from anyone in the City squad? Go James McAtee. Good shout. Player you'd want to sign on Ultimate Team? Um, Virgil van Dijk. Pineapple on pizza, yes or no? Uh, no, not for me. Good answer, I'm pleased you said that. This is crucial as well. Milk in tea, first or last? Uh, last. Oh, I knew you liked your CJ, good shout. Uh, socks or trousers on first in the morning? Uh, trousers. Sliders or slippers in the house? Slippers. What are you more afraid of, spiders or mice? Uh, I'm not really afraid of either, to be honest. 
What's the longest journey you've been on? Um, longest journey I've been on? Went to Malaysia a couple of years ago with City. Oh, amazing. How was that? Uh, yeah, great experience. Very different, though. Do you find yourself as a bit of a traveller? Do you want to sort of go yeah, around yeah, a bit more? Yeah, yeah, for sure. When I get time, I'd love to. What's the biggest inspiration outside of football? Um, my family. Do you play any instruments? No, I don't. Uh, how many languages do you speak? Uh, just one. English, I assume. Yeah, just English. <laughs> how, um, if you could play one match for the rest of your life, what match would it be that you've played in already? Um, I really enjoyed the FA Youth Cup final. That was a great game, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, great yeah, game. It's been amazing. Uh, what's the biggest lesson a family member's taught you in the past? Um, always stay humble and believe in yourself. And what actor would you want to play you in a movie of your life? Going on about humble and then talking about something like this. Um, <laughs> actor, I like Samuel L. Jackson a lot. What makes you happy in life? Uh, playing football. Aside from football, what's your greatest talent? Greatest talent, I'm very good at COD. Oh, nice, good shout. Yeah. And just finally, and I know this is a bit of a difficult question, but where do you see yourself in 10 years' time? Please don't um, say in front of a mirror. <laughs> hopefully in this, in this club's first team, that would be great. Nice one. Thanks for your time, CJ. We'll let you get going because I know you, you know you're busy. Thank you.